As you can see, the model comes with an investor summary, which is a printable two-page formatted summary with return calculations and high-level metrics. Next is an error check tab. This provides quick insights into the accuracy of your financial model. The next tab is a model outputs tab. This is used for investor relations reports, packages, and includes sources and uses, capital stacks, hypothetical investor returns, unit mix outputs, and much more. Now is the assumptions tab. This includes property details, timing assumptions, acquisition price, renovation assumptions by unit mix, exit, operating, annual inflation control, debt, and waterfall assumptions. This tab also includes a sensitivity table. The unit mix tab shows the ability to model various units and pricing structures broken out by each unit type. The model calculates property taxes based on the assessed value of the property and millage rates. In the financials tab, you can easily compare stabilized operations to historical financials. The renovation budget tab has the ability to control timing on each specific line item and select if the calculation is fixed, dollar per square foot, dollar per unit, or percentage. Monthly cash flow is a detailed monthly analysis of unlevered and levered cash flows. The annual cash flow tab is an output tab driven entirely by the monthly cash flow tab. The waterfall tab includes the number of tiers selected in custom model builder and breaks out the returns by LP and GP. The lease comps tab is an output tab and shows other comparable properties in the surrounding area. If CoStar is not readily available, you can input lease comps into this tab manually. The sales comps tab is an output tab and similar to the lease comps tab shows sales of comparable properties in surrounding areas. If CoStar is not readily available, you can input sale comps into this tab manually. The model incorporates CoStar exports, which are exports of lease comps and sale comps out of CoStar and into this Excel financial model. Finally, the model has a forward LIBOR curve used for floating rate debt. Contact us today so we can get to work on underwriting your transactions for your multifamily projects. I can't wait to work with you.